Joanna Myers. I am the sous chef here at Avalon, which means I am apprentice to the head chef, which is Carmen, my supervisor. Um, really never worked for anywhere that composted and recycled nearly this much, if at all. <laughs> um, so it's, it's really nice to see that happening in such an urban environment especially. Because, you know, you wouldn't expect Detroit of all places to be a really compost, recycling heavy kind of a city, but I think the people here really want that as part of the environment. So. I'm a lot more cautious of what I what I buy in that I don't um, I don't buy nearly so many like non recyclable things. And we have a garden so composting is something that we're gonna be using. cheeses or tomatoes, there are always going to be pieces that either break off or are, we can't use in some way. So um, those would be composted if they're organic, so like a tomato or, or a wedge of cheese that we can't use, those are compostable. You know. However, um, there are some things we can't compost, not very many though, which is nice. <laughs> these, these bottles, these are all recyclables. So these things we take out back and we can recycle them. It just depends on what it is, really, on whether or not it's recyclable. Um, like even our salad containers, even our salad containers are compostable. So cups you drink out of are compostable. You know, pretty much if we can make it compostable, we want it to be compostable. <laughs> and if we can't compost, we want to recycle it. So there's actually very few things that we actually throw away. One of the only things being our gloves. But you know, those are kind of a necessary. and the one black bag is our trash. So, and then once they're filled up, then then the bag will go out to the compost in the back. Hanging out on there. Uh-huh. That, I gather up the crumbs, we compost them. Anything I can get into a large enough amount, even crumbs, I'll throw in the compost. This is the back of Avalon. There's boxes, like bags that used to be flower bags. And then these, these, um, cans here. This is glass recycling. And then we've got papers and plastics. This is more papers and plastics. And then I think we have a metal. Yep. And then we've got the cardboards right behind you. So that's how we take care of everything. It's very organized. Even, um, even the sprouts. When we have the, the dirt and the little stem left over, we leave them out here. And actually the birds will come down and eat them. So those are the used pallets, and the, they'll take back the plastic containers, the place that um, that makes them. I think they reuse them or recycle them or something. But uh, the birds should do like the uh, little sprout seeds. <laughs> <laughs>